Okay, I'm gonna show you how to set up soft limits on Mach 3. I'm gonna go into the program. I'm gonna go ahead and select my controller. And let me move this camera back. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is go to configuration, homing limits, and this is where it's going to be done. So remember that. So first off, you want to find out where you want your soft limits to be. And a soft limit is a place where you're, it's kind of like a, a limit switch, but without having to wire anything in. It's, it's a soft limit in the software. So that way, whenever the machine travels to a certain point, it acts as a limit switch would, and it will stop your machine and Limit switches are usually used for keeping you from crashing your machine into the part or, or, or the other side of the machine itself. So limit switches are very ideal in, in keeping your machine from getting destroyed. So the first thing that we're going to do here is I'm going to click on this little thing here that says machine coordinates. Okay, notice it highlights red. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and move my machine a little bit. So if you notice in Z, it's 671 thousandths and five tenths. Okay. So what I want to do is wherever I want to make my soft limit, I'm going to move my machine to that location. So I'm going to show you a little demonstration on the machine itself. So, say I want to keep this block from crashing into the turret, the chuck. I'm sorry, the chuck. So what I would do is jog my machine up to it manually to where I want to put it. I'm going to move my X axis up so I can see. And just bring it as close as you want to, to where you're not crashing into nothing. You can, you can spin it freely and everything. It's a safe distance. Okay? Set this back up. Okay. Now that we know where we want to be, we can go ahead and, and zero that axis. So I want to reference all home. And so now we're Z'd out in Z. Now I can go to, and I'm also going to do it in X right now also. Okay, that's as far back as I want to go in X. That's my save point. So I'm going to reference all. Okay, and now I can go to configuration, homing and limits. Okay, and I've already worked this out. So I set my soft max to zero. And so in Z. And so essentially what that is saying is the soft max that that X, the Z axis will not travel any further than the Z, than zero. So right now it's as far as it will allow it to go. The travel on my bed is 10 inches. I set this to 7.75 for clearance because I have some attachments that I have on there and I don't want to crash into them. So I set it at Z negative 7.75. And so that is ideal for me 
so that way I don't crash into nothing. Now this is the slow zone. Slow zone I have set at a hundred thousandths. And what that means is when it's within a hundred thousandths of either one of these numbers, Z0 or Z negative 7.75, it will start slowing down to this speed, which is 20. And you can adjust that. You can adjust it faster, slower. 20% is, is perfect for me. And I'm going to give a demonstration now of, of what will happen with these settings. So, in order to enable it, you must push soft limits. If you do not click this button, it will not enable it and it will crash. So, I have it on soft limits. I'm going to take it off and move it forward a little bit. Just for the presentation. Okay, so soft limits is clicked. Go over to the lathe. Now watch this. I'm going to move it up in X and I'm going to try to crash. Here we go. Did you hear the motor power down? That's the soft limit. And that was at 20%. We'll try it again. And that will keep you from crashing. And I'm going to do it on the negative 7.75, which will be down here. So at a hundred thousandths before that, it will slow down to 20% until it gets to the destination and then it will stop. So that's negative 7.75. And that's the whole reason for soft limits. Because if I did not have that installed on there, if I didn't have it configured for that, it would continue to travel back and smash into this and tear some stuff up. These are pretty strong motors. They're NEMA 23s. And in order to keep from damaging stuff, you either need to install limit switches or set up your soft limits. It's very important.